All right, it's the baseline pull stock header, catalytic converter, and Yoshimira slip-on. With somebody else's flash. And 69 horsepower. Um, see, the air fuel is kind of all over the place, too. So, this bike, like I said, I don't know if you could hear me or not. I got the fuzzy thing on the mic. When the fuzzy thing's on the mic, it doesn't pick up audio good from behind it. 5,000 miles, slip on GSXR 1000. ECU has been flashed. I don't know who did it. I wouldn't tell you if I did know who did it. Anyways, it's going to have my stuff in it. 169. We're going to squash that <laughs> all right guys here we go all right guys here we go with another 2017 gsxr 1000 this one's a little different from the one we just dynoed this one's got a acro full exhaust this is a full system it has a bmc filter in it and it's on 93 octane pump gas we're gonna make these first pulls with a stock untouched ecu we'll see how much power it makes then we're gonna put the magic flash and tune on the ecu see what we can get out of this thing but this will be a good uh, comparison between the Brox exhaust and the Acro exhaust and then you can make the call for yourself whether you like the look of it the sound of it and the horsepower of either one so stay with us here we go Whoosh. all right guys we already got the engine warmed up let's see what pull number one gets us So right off the bat, you'll notice this exhaust is not quite as loud as the alien head. A lot of that is due to the length of the muffler.
right, so first pull, uh, it made 154.79, which is a little low, uh, but the bike was extremely rich from the factory. So anyways, we're gonna go in and uh, open it up and put a tune in it, see where we go, and then dyno tune it and get it just right from there. All right, guys, we got the exhaust system on the 2017 1000. This customer chose the Brock's Performance Alien Head 2. We're gonna be making some pulls on this thing. I have not flashed the ECU yet, so we ran it with the slip-on exhaust. Now this is just bolting the exhaust system on. We're gonna see what kind of power gains we get, and then we're gonna put that magic touch on the ECU, see what we get. All right, let's make a pull and get this thing going. Exhaust on, we've got an increase of 10 horsepower. We went from 169 to 179. Nice, good, solid power gains there. We're gonna smooth out this air fuel ratio and get this thing making some power. All right, guys, pull number two. This is the first pull with the flash DCU. <laughs> Just like that, picked up 20 horsepower with just the flash. That is our, I guess you would say, mail-in flash. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean your bike is gonna make 174 horsepower, yours may make more. Every bike is gonna be different. This bike actually only made 154 the first pull, which is definitely lower, ab abnormally lower than normal. So, like I said, just because this one made 174 with a mail-in tune doesn't mean that yours won't make more than that. But anyways, now we're gonna start with a dyno tuning process and get this thing finely tuned and dialed in. Comment in the comments below, which exhaust do you like better so far, just as far as the looks and the sound go? Do you like the Acro or do you like the Brox exhaust better? All right guys, here we go. This might be our final horsepower pull. We'll see how it goes.
179.71. We might as well call that 180. Pretty good for pump gas, BMC air filter. This is a BMC, I guess you would say race, that is not a Sprint F-185. So I think if you went with a Sprint F-185, uh, this thing would definitely be in the low 180s. I don't know, you make the call. Which exhaust would you rather have? I asked earlier, I'm asking again now, have you changed your mind after you've seen the horsepower? All right, guys, so we're finishing up the dyno here on this 2017 GSXR 1000. We are uh, completing the tuning process now. I'm gonna make a pull on this thing and we're gonna overlay the dyno graphs to show you what the differences are between the Acropovic Evolution and a Brox Alien Head. Now, I'm not saying that the Brox Alien Head is a better exhaust system than a, Brock, than a Acropovic Evolution. Every bike is different. So in other words, we could put this same Brox exhaust on his bike and it might make one horsepower more, one horsepower less, five horsepower more, five horsepower less. All I can tell you is this bike makes this amount of horsepower, his bike makes that amount of horsepower. You can kind of come to your own conclusions as far as which ones you like, which one makes better numbers. In this particular situation, this Brox exhaust has made better power and we're gonna overlay the Dynagraphs to show you. So we're gonna make our last pull right now. does have 4,900 miles on it. Look at the horsepower we got here. So you can see we made a solid 187 horsepower. Now I'm gonna go back and find the other customers runs and pull those up for you with the Acro Evolution exhaust. It did make less horsepower. And like I said, different things, different. there's so many different variables when it comes to dyno runs. So the tire can make a difference. Uh, I, I don't, uh, I think the customer had a BMC air filter where this one has a Sprint 185 air filter. So it's not a fair comparison for just the exhaust systems. The, cu the other customer I think had a factory tire on his bike. I, I can't remember. It's like I said, this video and the other video is several days in a apart. Uh, I'm looking for his dyno runs now. All right, so here are the dyno graphs overlaid together. And so you see he went, I'm gonna pull up several different ones everywhere we've got a little bit of difference in the horsepower. So realistically, uh, you can see the air fuel curves are almost the exact same too, as far as the way the tune is done. 
So the tune is exactly the same, uh, or I'm not gonna say exactly the same, same air fuel. Um, so anyways, I don't know, you make the call. What do you think, guys? Which exhaust would you rather have? Which one do you like best? Uh, so I definitely know that the Sprint F-185 air filter is definitely better than the uh, BMC or k &N air filter, which is what the other customer had. Uh, so I definitely, I mean, I, I don't know. This Brox exhaust Sprint F-185 air filter, more Mafia tune, hard to beat. All right, guys, let me know what you think. Be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. If you enjoyed this video, give us an old thumbs up. And that's going to do it for today, guys. See ya.